All right, man, let's get this motherfucking shit crack a lacking. Fuck's popping everybody. It's your boy, that pussy 445 up in the house. Um, Eagles traveled to Jacksonville, Florida. I guess it's called Everbank Field now. The last time I checked, the shit was called All Taylor Stadium. Guess they changed it, right? To take on the Jacksonville Jaguars. Now, I'll put it like this, man. I'm expecting the Eagles to whip this team's fucking ass. You know what I'm saying? And when, and when I mean whip they ass, I'm not talking about no bullshit ass 14 to 9, no motherfucking 31 to 22 type shit. I'm I'm expecting the Eagles to whip this team's ass at least 31 to 10 or 31 to 17, okay? I'm not I'm not talking about no pussyfoot ass motherfucking 14 to 9 and all all that bullshit, okay? Because as you guys know, the starters will get the first two quarters, and then I guess the I guess the second string will get the second quarter um, or, um, behind Nick Foles, and then the rest of the motherfuckers will get the last quarter. Only thing is that I'm not I'm not too sure if Foles will get the last two quarters or will it be Foles the third quarter and then Dennis Dix in the fourth quarter. I'm not sure, you know. But reflecting on Reflecting on how the Eagles played last week, their offense-wise, offense-wise versus the Panthers, you feel me? Let's be real. Um, as I said before, this is a dress rehearsal game for the Eagles. The Eagles should have no problem walking up and down the field on this sorry-ass fucking team. I mean, who, nigga, who the fuck does the Jags got? Mercedes, I don't even know if that motherfucker even still even still plays with the goddamn team. Um, the only real threat they really have is MJD, Maurice Jones-Drew, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not trying to sound fruity or fruity tooty in the motherfucking booty or anything. I'm just saying, Maurice Jones-Drew got some thick-ass legs, thick-ass thighs, okay? You know what I'm saying? And... If you decide to try to take his ass out low, the shit ain't going to happen. You got to take him out out high, you, you, up high, okay? You can't take him out down low. He got big ass legs, okay, on some Michael Turner type shit, okay? So, I expect the offense to walk up and down the field upon these motherfuckers. But then again, at the same time, you can't take nobody for granted, okay? Yes, I understand it's the goddamn preseason, so please don't leave a fucking comment. Oh, calm down. You're getting hype over pre motherfucker. I get hype. I get hype over every Eagles game, okay? I don't give a fuck if it's a preseason game, a regular season game, if it's a meaningless game at the end of the season. I get hype and I get pumped for every Eagles game, okay? I don't give a fuck if it's a pointless damn game. Okay? I'm sorry, nigga. That's just me. I get pumped before every game. You know what I'm saying? Don't matter if it's a preseason game or not. You know, defense. Defense, 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 man. All I got to say is this. Kerry Williams, you talking that shit? I got my eyes on you, pimp. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, nigga, you, you ain't the, nigga... I'm not the only motherfucker you got to worry about. You know what I'm saying? You got the whole goddamn Eagles fan base. You know what I'm saying? Looking at you. At, you got Philly fan for life looking at you. You got Eagles fan for life 17 looking at you. You got Philadelphia looking at you. You know what I'm saying? You got motherfucking Ripper Eagle 96 looking at you. You got Nitro Freak looking at you. Man, you got the motherfucking librarian down the street. You know what I'm saying? He's looking at you. Everybody is looking at your ass, okay? Because, you know what I'm saying? You was quick to talk this shit, my nigga. You talking all this shit with your seventh round pick having ass self. And I understand you had a slight injury, but at the same time, you quick to get up in our ear hole and shit. I want to see how quickly you're going to get up in other niggas' ear holes. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I mean, fuck, even if you get burnt, motherfucker, still talk some shit. Talk some trash. I mean, fuck it. Like, you know what I'm saying? Um, so defense-wise, man, I want to see what Kerry Williams is going to do. I want to see what that big motherfucker Vinnie Curry is going to do. Trent Cole, nigga, what the fuck, my nigga? Where are you at, pimp? Like, you know, I understand that you're more of a 4-3 defensive end, but I want to see what you're going to do also, man. I know you kind of been... 
you know, I, I, I ain't really seen your ass. You feel me? During, during this preseason, you know. Other than that, Vinny Curry should have a ball. Um, Damian Square, I understand, you know, he's kind of under the bus, but I like Damian Square on some real ass shit. You know, um, of course, you guys know we're running a 3-4. I still want to see us blitzing like we blitzed last week versus the Carolina Panthers, you know what I'm saying? Um, I know Patrick Chung ran in upon the blitz, and when they snapped the ball, he backed out in coverage, you know what I'm saying? Like, I fucking loved, you know, what Connor Barwin was doing, how they was using him, you feel me? He was also rushing upon the edge to help assist that motherfucking pass rush, you know? So I want to see what the defense is going to do also, as far as blitzing the quarterback-wise, you feel me? So, nigga, if you want to send some all-out blitzes, the preseason is the time to do it, okay? Um, with that being said, defense, defense, do your fucking job. Offense, keep doing your thing, man. I want to see that high-tempo offense. Y'all motherfuckers, you know, Vic looking calm as fuck up in that pocket. Keep doing your thing, pimp, and we shall see. Until next time, y'all, catch y'all niggas later. Y'all have a good one. Defense put Blaine Gabbert on his motherfucking ass and beat the shit out of these Jacksonville Jaguars. Holla back. Y'all have a good one. Peace.